slide to introduce Carol from England, who takes LDM for multiple sclerosis. Good morning, Carol. Good morning. Could you tell me when you were diagnosed with MS? Um, about 20 years ago. Oh, you've had it quite a while. How old were you? In my 40s. I was about 45. Right. And what symptoms were you experiencing at that time which led to your diagnosis? Well, I, I, went, I was very, very fit and I went up to the shop one day and my legs just gave way. Uh, I went back home and from the doctor, my leg stuck out, it would go, but it wouldn't go down. And two years later, it told me it was a mess. Right. So how did that impact on your life, Carol? A lot, a lot, because I was very, very fit. Mm -hmm. uh, I used to help my husband with uh, his boys and girls club. We used to go fell walking, camping, swimming, very, very fit. I used to even, we used to even take children abroad on activity holidays. And all of a sudden, that stopped, you know, I couldn't walk properly. Oh, dear. So it had a Im big impact on your life then, didn't it? It did, very yes. big. And how did that affect you psychologically? Um, I just realised that I couldn't do... I felt that it was God telling me it was time to rest. <laughs> right. So before you found LDN, how had your MS progressed? It was uh, going downhill. Um I was they I was weakening. Uh, I couldn't walk properly. Uh, the biggest thing was I was getting very weak and getting very depressed. That mm -hmm. was the biggest things. And jump my legs were jumping a lot. Did you have any problems with your bladder? Uh, now and again. <laughs> and what, what about fatigue? Was fatigue a problem? Uh, fatigue was the biggest one of the, the weakness. I was just so weak. Mm -hmm. That's that was about the biggest thing. I was just so weak. And how did you hear about LDN? I was at the hairdressers and I read a magazine and it was mentioned in the magazine. A lady had been using it mm -hmm. and she could now bother with her grandchildren and that's when I wanted to... <laughs> that was my story, Carol. I don't know <laughs> whether you know that. No. Yeah, it was me. Um, and a picture of my little grandson, which was quite nice. Um, how did you go about getting a prescription? My husband went on his computer and it was all done through then and through Glasgow and that was it. Mm -hmm. We just ordered it and that was soon it came. And how long have you been taking LDN now? Uh, about four or five years. Okay. And how has it helped your condition? Um, my legs don't jump. I'm not as weak as I was. Uh, I've got a lot more positive attitude. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I'm trying to think... I am in a wheelchair when I'm out, and I push a zimmer when I'm in. Um, we have a big house, so I've got a stair lift. Um, just thankful that the children and my husband didn't get it. Um, and, yeah, I'm a lot more positive about it. Mm -hmm. Will you continue to take LDN? Oh, yes. What would you say to other people with MS who are contemplating trying LDN? Try it. It's worth doing, yes. It, if nothing else, it takes a weakness away and a jump in. Mm -hmm. And are, are you able to join in more now, Carol? No, I can't do anything. Uh, I've got preaching. Um, I can't do anything in the house because of the weakness and because of um, not walking very far, weakness in my hands. I do write letters to people 
Mm -hmm. Elderly people, people that can't write back, uh, and I go preaching every now and again. But I can't read very much, uh, much about it. Well, it sounds as though you're still having a productive life, though, doesn't it? You know. Oh yes, yeah. I'm very, very um, sure that yeah, it's better me than the family. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you very much for sharing your story with us. You're welcome. Right. It did affect my family when I first got it. Uh, I have twins, and they were away from home. But I have a middle daughter who was taking exams, and she couldn't stop crying. It, it really hit her. Uh, they had to keep sending her home from school. And then I have triplets, and they were too young really to act. Except it, they are just starting to understand it a bit better now. My goodness, you've you've got quite a large family with twins. Oh well, we had foster we had foster children as well, and I was oh, bothered that goodness. they were going to be taken away. Yeah. But no, we were able to keep them. Oh, lovely! Oh, thank you very much, Carol. You're very very well.